Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Dude, where is my beer? For more point and click adventure game action, we are back where we left off. Last time we managed to get into the crypt and we spoke to the bartender there who told us about a secret chat group where we might be able to get a lead for a pilsner. And I was having a bit of a think um, and I wondered if that was a chat group on a phone because you might remember in an earlier episode we came in here and we noticed that there was, in fact, a phone on this table. So I wondered if we could look at this phone and potentially find what we need. Looks like it belongs to the bartender. Hey, don't touch my phone. Okay, maybe we can talk to her about it then. Uh, I'm looking for a beer called Halvliter. Do you know where I can find it? No, I told you, we don't have Pilsners here. So you do know it's a Pilsner. What? You just said, listen, I don't have time for this. Hmm, okay, so she's hiding something. Uh, do you know about that secret time hog chat group for bartenders? Yes, do you want me to tell you about it? Yes, that would be nice. Well, I can't, because it's secret. Ha! Uh, okay. Uh, okay, can I borrow your phone for a second, please? What? No! Okay, so maybe we're going to have to find a way to to get that phone, perhaps. But if it's a secret chat for bartenders, perhaps there's lots of bartenders who could potentially have a way for us to use it. I don't know. Uh, let's try going on a round of all the bars then and seeing if we can perhaps find a bartender who will let us know a bit of information. Let's talk to this guy. <coughs> uh, do you have half liter? Hmm. You know what? That name rings a bell, but I don't know where I saw it. Did someone mention it in the time hub group? Hey, what? Have you been snooping around my phone? No? I'm on to you. Uh, okay then, so the answer is no in that instance. Uh... Big Dog Sports Bar. Don't suppose we know anything about it in here. Do you know anything about uh, a beer, please? Anything special? Do you have half litre? Hmm. You know what? That name rings a bell, but I don't know where I saw it. Uh, maybe you saw it in a beer magazine? Hmm, I'm not sure. Uh, maybe you saw it online somewhere? Ah, could be. I might have seen something in that time hog chat group for us bartenders. Right, so he knows about the chat group. Isn't that chat group secret? I don't think so, is it? Uh, no, that group is not secret at all. I've heard it is yes, I'm not sure. Uh, no, it's not secret. In that case, I can check it for you. Thanks a lot. Okay. You're welcome, buddy. Uh, are you checking it? Okay, so, have you checked the time hub group yet? Hi again, no, I'll do that after work. Uh, it's very important, could you check it now? May I borrow your phone to check that group? Uh, it's very important, could you check it now? Wait, look! What? Not again, what happened with the defence? Could you... I can check it after work. When do you close? We closed 3.30, last call 3 o'clock. Uh, okay, can we try the other option? May I borrow your phone to check that group? Wait, look! What? Buy some glasses, you twat referee! <laughs> so may I borrow your phone? No, I can check it after work. When do you close? We close 3.30, okay. So, that's pretty annoying. So can we... We tried picking this up, didn't we? Yeah, he doesn't let us do it. What are you doing? Don't even think about it. It's the game of the year. I'm sorry, I didn't know that. Well, now you do. Okay, there is a phone over here, though, so I wonder if that's his phone. A phone. One of those smart ones, I guess. Hey, leave my phone alone. Yeah, so it is his phone. Okay, so maybe we can get his phone off of him. Uh, we talked about that. We can't get a beer here, can we? We need to get a Guinness, but we need the right time. It's going to take a while. Oh, okay. Is it... Ah. We can get a Guinness. 
Oh, so we can get one now. Right, let's drink it. Guinness is not bad. I remember having a few pints back in the day. But I still miss a good refreshing pills now. That gives me an idea, though. Can we get another Guinness? It's going to take a while. Can we take his phone while he's doing that? No. Can we... Okay. Can we take the control while he's doing that? Okay, I don't... Ah. He doesn't want to drink anymore. Uh, okay, so that's a bit irritating. Um, I, mean, I don't suppose we can ask him for another Guinness. Or will he just say that we're not... Uh, can I have another Guinness? You should drink the one you already have. Okay, right. So we're going to have to... We're going to have... Okay, well that worked perfectly. Just going outside did it. Um, so, it must be the fresh air sobering us up. Uh, a beer, please. Yeah, can you get the Guinness? And I'm going to try and steal that remote control. Oh yeah, of course. Right. We've drunk it. Now let's let's um, ask for another Guinness. And let's see if we can steal the remote control for the TV while he's doing that. We can. Okay. I pick up the remote control while the bartender is busy doing the thing with the Guinness. Right, thank you. Can we... Yeah, come on. Come on, shoot. <laughs> Achievement unlocked social disturber. Hey, bartender, fix the TV while wow, they're getting mad. Sure, wait a sec. I have to find the remote. Fix the TV now. <laughs> He's hiding. <laughs> what is this program? Uh, okay, he gone. Can we take his phone? I guess I can check his phone now. What could the code be? Oh god, okay. Um... <laughs> that code was wrong. 1111. No. Uh, 9999? No, okay. Huh. So we don't know the code. Okay, it won't actually let us take the... Can we use this? It's not my job. Uh, so we need to figure out the code then. Look at all these people. <laughs> They're so mad. Uh, right, if we go out and come back, does he go back to the... He does. How did he change it back to the football if we've got the remote controls? Answers on a postcode. Uh, postcode? Postcard. <laughs> Answers on a postcode. What am I talking about? Um, okay, what's the code to your phone? What? I mean, what is a significant four-digit number for you? That would definitely be the year we made it to the finals. And that would be... No, it's not possible that he didn't catch that. Please come back later. I have to see this. No, I need to come back now. Uh, okay, so we need to find out the year they got to the finals. So is there anyone else in here that knows that? Too busy watching the game. Uh, Magnus, do you know the year they got to the finals? Too busy watching the game. Maybe Woodrow knows. Uh, can you tell me about the game? That's the game of the decade. These two teams have been in the same finals only once. We have to win this so badly. Why is this game so important? Because we lost the last time back in March of... Hey, what just happened? Isn't that a penalty? I'm sorry, I have to see this. Okay. Uh, is the answer on the walls? What's this? It's a framed t-shirt with pate on it. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, it doesn't look like it. So... Hmm. Could the guy in the quiz, the quiz master, know the answer? Or the quiz, like the quiz expert, the quiz king, whatever it is, does, could he potentially know the year that they won? I don't even know the team's name, but whoever it is won. Let's try it, quiz king. Oh, okay, yeah. 
we need to have a drink first. I'll drink this Guinness. Okay, Quiz King. Uh, do you know anything about a beer called Half Liter? We may as well ask that while we're here. Yes, I know it, but I don't drink beer for sissies. So you do know what it is? Listen, let me tell you something. I'm the Quiz King. It means that I can answer all the questions in the world. But only when a licensed quizzer asks them, not a random person like you. Are you a licensed quizzer? No, I didn't think so. I understand. Uh, have an interesting question you up for the challenge. Depends. Depends on what? Depends on what kind of question it is. Well, isn't it easier if I just ask the question you can decide if you answer it or not? Sounds reasonable. What's the question? Uh, no. Okay. So maybe the quiz guy? Excuse me. I'm a bit busy here. Uh, yes. Quiz. Yes. Do you know anything about the half litre? Well, I'm asking the questions here. So get lost now. Okay, he won't tell us anything. Where does the name IP... Okay. So, no, he doesn't... Hmm. He doesn't know either. So perhaps the answer is... Potentially... In the bar? Or perhaps this guy knows. He's a sports dude. Ah, okay, we need to get another drink because we're sober again. Uh, right, bartender, give me a Guinness. Anything special? Yes, a Guinness, please. It's going to take a while, blah, 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 blah. Give me my drink. Right, let's use the drink. We'll ask for another one. Another Guinness, please, buddy. It's going to take a while. Wait, did we try asking him if he knows the year? Or is that, is that not an option? Uh, no, it's not a question. Okay. Let's try asking the sports mascot, because I wonder if, because he's like a sports guy, whether he'll know the answer. Uh, hey, how are you? Much better, thank you for the refreshing, refreshing smoothie. No problem. How can I help you? Uh, I need to say something about Bruble Finals. Okay, maybe he does know. Sure, what do you need? Uh, when was the last time the home team played the Nordic Finals of Bruble? That's easy. It would have been before I was born. That's great. What year was that? I wouldn't know. Ugh, okay, he doesn't know. <laughs> Why not? I told you it was before my time. Right, so we need someone old then, do we? You're an ignorant mascot. No, I'm a friendly monster. Uh, can you give me some hints so I can guess the year? Sure, but I'm no good with dates. You should ask me a few questions to help me help you. Uh, so you're telling me it was before your time. Was it before the 60s? Hey, I'm not that old. But the answer is yes. I, it was before that, I think. Was it before World War II? Oh yeah, it was before that war. Ah, okay, so was it before World War I? Yes, it was before that war as well. Was it, all, was it at all in the 20th century? You know what? I'm suddenly not sure when it was, but tell me. Why do you need it? Well, I'm not supposed to tell you this, but... I'm trying to access the bartender's phone at Big Dog's Sports Bar. Really? Big Dog's phone? Is Big Dog's his name? No, his name is Big Dog, and the bar's name is Big Dog's. But Big Dog's is the correct way to write possessive form in Norwegian. Ah, I didn't know that. See, we learned something in this game. Anyway, I have to disappoint you. The code has nothing to do with Bruegel or the Nordic Finals. What is it? You know it? Yes, that's actually my old phone. Oh my god. <laughs> I gave it to Big Dog when we started dating, and I know what he changed the code to. The code is the year of birth of his favourite historical person, the founder of Guinness. I don't really know when it was, but I'm sure it was before both World War I and World War II. Well, thanks for nothing. The, found the, the, the year of birth of the founder of Guinness. Where the hell are we going to figure that out? We might have to do a bit of a Google search on that. Uh, unless we can ask him. Uh, no, we can't. Hmm. Okay, well, we've made some progress at least. We need to find out the year 
the, the founder of Guinness was born, but we're going to do that in the next one. So as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new, or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.